What's up guys, back with another vlog. And as you can see, I am really tired. Like, oh my God, I'm just so tired right now. So today is gonna be a bit of a busy day. Um, so Jamie's gonna go to London to go to work. Um, I'm gonna walk out with her to the train station, come back. And at 11 o'clock, uh, my um, brother needs to come over to us to film and do an interview with me about like my work, uh, about my freelancing job. So that should be something today. So when I get on back, I don't know whether I'm gonna like just go back to sleep and take get like get some more recovery in me or just power on through the day. Either way, all right, let's get going. So we are now out. And what we're going to be doing is actually stopping by a convenience store to get some energy drinks. Or Starbucks over here for us. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'll show you what we get on the way back. So again, I know no one asked, but these are the energy drinks we got. So this is Jamie. She told me to take this home because she wants to try it later. A matcha um, drink. <laughs> I think it's an energy drink. I'm really not sure. Um, Two double shot espressos. All right, these are really good. Okay, because I remember having one of these before, and oh my god, I went from like not even being able to like talk to actually like functioning properly. <laughs> and so I normally get like the original boost, but they're like different flavors. So I went for with tropical berry. I wanted to give you some more story. So the reason why my brother's coming over over to interview me is um, for his university project. He does film and he needs like, like a video of me and my work just to, and I need to explain like the benefits that have been during lockdown. Like there's a lot of disadvantages but there's, all, there's also like stuff that's actually helped people out. I've been getting a lot more clients in shall I say because I started like posting a lot more Instagram and putting stuff on my websites. I'm like, it's because I'm not being able to get a job, that's the thing, because there's loads of like companies that I just have to like, you know, let people go and they need like very like high professional people to start working there now, which is understandable. Like, yeah, like to get the business going, you need to make sure people know what they're doing. And so what I've done, I've, been able to make a living off just freelancing at the moment. So people come in and ask for me to do an like, well, email me, ask me to do an animation for them, a music video, it could be an advertisement or anything like that. And yeah, that's what's helped me out really to get by, like even in lockdown. So not being able to get a job at the company, but being able to like support myself literally by being by hiring myself to actually do the work for people. So if any of you have seen my, my last vlogs, I do like, like, I don't intentionally do this, but I do mumble a lot. So I try to speak as clear as I can, but I forget. And when I forget, it, I talk really fast and then no one can understand me, especially with my mask on. Like, my, my, that, that video with that shop to Tesco's, I couldn't even understand myself. That's the thing. And I speak too fast and I do mumble, yeah, I mumble a lot. And imagine me doing an interview, like, or, like, reporting the news, the news and all that. So like, it wouldn't go well because I'd be told to slow down and open my mouth up more widely so that I can speak clearly to everyone. It's time to see what this mother effer can do. It will do a lot. Just with one can, it will just do you fine. So this is the scene I've been doing for one of my clients so far. Oh, he's not playing. Oh, that's, a, that's a good song. Okay, there we go. It's an animatic. So he gets out of his car, walk in to the house. He's going to stop by the house, and then we're going to have another shot of the girl in the window. Yeah, that, that car is so weird. Like, I just, I couldn't really think of what car to have, so I'm rolling with it. So, my brother's here, and he's going to be filming me doing the interview. Um... Yeah, so he, I'm filming him, filming me doing this. What's your clients been, have, they, have your clients been more demanding in lockdown? So, over time, 
yes, um, because as I'm been given more time to myself to actually get my work out there. Mate, cut. You got to say I'm not answering the question. You got to say the question in the answer. Do you get? So like during lockdown. Oh, for yeah. Some... <laughs> yeah. So during lockdown, there has been a more demand for to the animation on my behalf because I'm able to put my work out a lot more on Instagram, I've been having a lot more time to myself to build my show real work, and then put it out um, uh, on my Instagram, my website, and that's attracted a lot more audiences. I, I, I tried, I tried there. Um, now this one gets... Um, was, that, was that was that right yeah. now, yeah? So I'm going to just get some more footage of you drawing. Okay, well, you can have this. No, we always do it over the, over the shoulder. All right, wait, wait, don't, wait, don't do it yet. Right. No, I'm going to try and do some... I'm just, just going over my own work here. Client work. What have um what have you been doing uh, during lockdown? So during lockdown, so at the start I was um, doing music videos, and these bands from America like hired me to do a music um, uh, to the animation for them. So it was literally just showcasing the world around um, this person's point of view. That was um, based in New York, and now it's gone to creating short films for my current cli clients at the moment. So one of them wants um, to show the habitat of um, polar bears, how global warming has impacted on them. Yeah, right, last question. Um, what's the future? So the future now is to uh, currently um, carry on with um, my current client projects, trying to get these um, short films done whilst also applying for um, animation companies, studios, so such as The Line Animation, Golden Wolf, uh, Blue Zoo. It's trying to apply for a stable job uh, other than rely on freelance, but also develop my own skills so then I can put it out right, onto my website, uh, my Instagram, my social media, so then I can grab more attention. Yeah. So this is Dad's tripod. Yeah, that's a tripod. And how long is it taking you to get it off? Ten minutes. <laughs> it takes ten minutes just for it to unscrew it all. It's like it's jammed on a bit. Huh. Now I'm going to open this pack, actually. So, this is the new stuff we got. So, I'm not really sure what this... Oh, it's like a um, frame. Like a picture frame. That you have here. Yeah, Pikachu on it. And we have a maze. So to find Charmander. Okay, so yeah, I'm at a different desk at the moment. All right, so I'm gonna be opening up these. First one is Mudkip. Chikorita. Oh, we got a Pikachu. Nice. And for the Hollow. Oh, we've got a new one, Chimchar Hollow. Look at that. And then, okay, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's um, me. So, being interviewed. Be, uh, James is reviewing it. Um, okay, guys, after careful consideration, I am going to take a nap because I'm so tired. I'm not going to be able to get through a lot of work. The thing is, if I do any of my client work whilst like half asleep, it's not good work and it gets scrapped literally when I'm fully awake and I just have to redo everything all over again. So this is why I like, just accept it, just get some sleep and rest in you and then actually do it. Cause then it will be good work and then I can put it forward to, like, to the client much easier. Also, James, uh, my brother like left uh, enough of ice cream and all that and he gave it to me, but I'm gonna give it to Jamie because I think she's having a hard day at work, so I'll give it to her then. And I've got to have Jamie's lunch that she's packed to me. Yay. So, Jamie made me another lunch. It's a picture of Kitty. My lunch. And then it says, please turn over. And then it says, haha, nah, it's yours. Have a nice day. I love you, bubs. Thank you, bubby. I love you too. And... Yeah, look, these are the Japanese sweets we got ages ago. Now she's just giving them to me. Oh, and chocolate sandwich. 
Jamie's in the background just saying, oh, remember to say that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, look, look. Same as what I got last time. And look, Kit Kat. And if anyone was wondering, this is what Jamie got in her Happy Meal. She got Hollow Mudkip, Torchic, and a pig. I shall film me drinking this. I'm not drinking it right. Just drink it like a normal drink. It's like sparkling water a bit. It's melon. They have this glass ball at the top and basically you punch it with that plastic just oh. and come down here. It's actually all right. When you start tasting it a lot more, it tastes all right. Some people actually collect these balls. Like, they're hard to get oh. out, but people like, like to get them out. Guys, look how much fried rice Jamie is making. Like, it's a whole wok. It's for two days. It's utopian. Look, there's even snow and ice all over the, the east. Ooh. Okay, guys. And this is the scene I've been working on. Animatic, so it's going to be very choppy. For one of my clients. Yeah. It took me actually a while to actually figure out the perspective on this. And yeah. Rough for now, but it'll be smooth in the future. Okay, everyone. I'm going to end the vlog here. I don't normally end it like so early on in the day. I normally just wait till like nearly midnight and then I'll end it. But tonight I'm going to end it early because I want to get this video up for you guys and I want to go to bed early because last time it took so long and yeah, it was just a hassle and I lost a lot of sleep. So I'm going to get my sleep back and I'll be vlogging tomorrow and hopefully have a lot more time to spend with you. Yeah, so till then, take care and I will see you tomorrow. Until then, bye-bye.